welcome everybody y'all i'm back with another video so let's get into it let's see what messages we have for the collective let's see what's going on let's get a message from here let's see oh wow we got some jumpers I want to feel this way again. Just being near you is intoxicating. Wow. Somebody is saying that they hope that you can forgive them one day and they wish they could take their words back. So somebody is wishing that they never said what they said and they're just hoping that you can forgive them one day. They want to come back around you, be around you, feel you, be in your presence. Because being near you is just it for them. I'm so attracted to you. This person is definitely wondering if you're happy without them. Okay? This person is definitely. They want to know how's life going since you two haven't been around each other since y'all haven't been together okay all right so let's see if we can find out more let's see let's see what went wrong in this connection before we jump into the tarot because this this reading is definitely like i'm ready let's talk let's talk let's talk i gotta get this off my chest type of Somebody is super duper attracted to you. So one way wrong in this connection. What went wrong in the connection? Oh, somebody is not that good in the bedroom. So y'all last connection, y'all both was bored of each other. Y'all both got tired of each other. And the fire, it just seemed like the passion left. The passion wasn't there anymore. Fun moments that led to ghosting afterwards. Oh, wow. Wow. Somebody was suffering in this connection. Okay. This connection was suffering badly. Because maybe the, um, the passion died in this connection. There was little to no passion. So the connection just phased out. Yeah, needing space. I don't know how to tell you I need some space without hurting your feelings. They needed some space or you needed space. And they was hooking up with people. They was hooking up. We got party hookup. Friends killed it for you or them. Their friends was telling them to entertain other people, pushing them up, pushing them up to entertain other people. And this person refused to grow. So they created their own blockages. So they regret listening to all these people telling them, let's hang out, let's go over here, let's jump, party hopping. Going from party to party, hooking up with this person and that person. It caused this connection to suffer badly. Like y'all wasn't even getting it cracking in the bedroom no more. And then on top of that, I feel like a lot of y'all outgrew this connection and this person just couldn't keep up they couldn't keep up with the connection anymore wow what else thank you spirit that was confirmation this person is thinking about you they're thinking about a fresh start they want a fresh start with you. But they know that they have to let... They want this fresh start with you. But they know that they're dealing with another party. They will have to let that go. So this is something that they're contemplating. That they'll have to reinvent themselves. Okay? They'll have to completely reinvent themselves all over again. And I feel like this person is afraid of starting over. It took this person a lot of time to... To understand this connection. Okay. It took this person a while. They had to go see if the grass was greener. And it took them a, a while for them to recognize the connection. 
Wow. Now this person is at a crossroad. Okay, they're at a crossroad. And they're afraid of this connection. For some reason, we got fear and soulmate. They're afraid to come towards you because we got conclusion and return because of family, okay? Their family may not want them to come back towards you. And you and this person being in separation, this is, a lot of you guys is twin flame. They're having major regrets, okay? Major regrets. They may have gave you an offer out of their pride and ego, and maybe you declined the offer, and now this person is stuck. They're stuck, and now they want to play the victim, okay? They want to play the victim role. So they were listening to other people when it came to you guys' connection, and that is why the connection um, fizzled out. Instead of them listening to themselves, they listened to other people. So they had a little following train going on. Can you tell me about this person? How does this person feel? Page of Wands. Nine of Swords, yep. They made a bad choice. When it came to their love life, they don't make good decisions. When it comes to their love life, they're realizing it. They tried to sabotage you, and I'm going to keep it real. They tried to sabotage you. They tried to make you jealous. I don't feel like it worked out how they wanted it to. It actually backfired on them. Wow. So they're dealing with somebody else, a third party. They were dealing with a third party to try to make you jealous. And it backfired. And they're spying on you. They've been spying on you the whole time. Somebody got tired of seeing y'all together, starting arguments with each other. Um, I do see like the ten of swords in the star is saying that there's no hope. Like somebody gave up hope for the situation. Somebody gave up hope for the situation. King of Wands could be a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But this person is very impulsive. Yep. This person tried to make you jealous. It did not go how they thought it was going to go. Somebody, this mess man also tried to have like mind control over you. Five of Pentacles. This person feels lost. Queen of Cups. You could be a water sign. Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. I'm hearing don't fit in. Maybe you didn't fit in with their group, their family, their friends. Like you were too different, I'm hearing. Yeah, and they, they started judging you. Yeah, the devil. They started painting you out to be the devil. They started judging you. three of swords this person is heartbroken um <laughs> wow okay wow wow
Wow. There was a tower moment. Okay. Yeah, that I feel like this person feels like they put in a lot of effort and it fell apart. Okay. They're having regrets. They think about it every day. They think about you every day. I'm here and seeing what you're going to... They want to see what you think. See what you feel about you guys' connection in it. Do you want to end it for good? Or do you want to talk about it? This has been on this person's mind a lot. Could be a Virgo. This person thought, this masculine thought that when they were with you, they were a good man. They feel like they did, you know, they slowed their, their life down to be with you and it fell apart. So they decided to move on. They decided they to go with another option. Could be a queen of swords involved. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. This person feels like you don't take them serious. I'm hearing uh, somebody's trying to force somebody to change their lifestyle, like their habits. I'm hearing lifestyle, though. Somebody didn't take somebody serious in the connection and somebody had made some changes to their lifestyle. Yeah, I'm hearing a lot, seeing a lot of back and forth coming into the near future. Wow, this person is really at a dilemma because they're at a crossroad. They really truthfully are at a crossroad. They're not sure if things are completely ended. I'm hearing can't go back on my word. If I go back, then I'm stuck. And they want to maybe like keep things a secret, but they don't talk so much trash about you to their friends and their family they just don't feel like you know they, they're looking at how they'll look I keep hearing change my lifestyle, change the lifestyle. Okay, three of swords is the outcome. And the eight of wands, this person owes you an apology. They owe you an apology. They feel like they owe you an apology. They're just trying to figure out what they're going to say. Yep. This person feels like y'all both should apologize to each other or they just feel like they owe you an apology. Mm. 
Also, I'm seeing them being kind of forced or pushed into this connection with this other party, like feeling obligated. This masculine knows what they did in the connection was real fucked up. But I'm hearing we weren't together at the time. So you make this seem like we was, but we wasn't. Um, they think looking at all the work that was put in, Ten of Wands and the Three of Pentacles, they feel like they're going to regret it if they don't stay in the connection. So somebody that they're dealing with has already put in a multitude of work. They've already, this karmic already has bent over backwards, did everything. So this masculine feels obligated to this other party. But I feel like this person just feels guilty. I'm hearing you feel like a man's supposed to do all the work. That's where this other party come in at and you try to make it seem like you're so perfect but you're not this person is wish they would have waited because they got a lot of people in their business this person is starting to realize the truth though that they should have waited to end this connection and walk away um their intuition is telling them that they need to come to you and apologize they know it's the right thing to do to fix the, just to fix you guys' connection. I feel like this person wants to return and have a new start with you. But this person is afraid of of uh, the backlash that he's going to get from the community, family. Um, this person is afraid of the backlash. Yep, I'm hearing this person feels like they keep making mistakes. And they like to look at what their friends and other people in their circle are doing. And I feel like they try to keep up an image. They don't want to be looked at, you know, they don't want to be looked at at a certain way. This person thinks about you every day, nonstop, trying to figure out a way to come to you. I'm here. <laughs> Friends telling, friends telling him, you gave this situation too many chances. You need to cut that out. You need, to, you need to let it go. So this person was definitely listening to other people when it came to this connection with you. This person also feels like kind of afraid because they feel like you may ha have too much control over the relationship. They're not able to come in and just do any old thing. So they're trying to find a way to communicate this to you.
Yeah, I'm getting that this person has to tell the truth. This is something that they've been dealing with that's been on their mind. This person feel like they should have stuck around and waited to make some changes instead of, um, you know, looking at the situation the way that they did. Mm. So this masculine is trying to find a way to come towards you to tell you tell you how they feel. I feel like this masculine also is afraid that you may have like you may be too too much for this individual. Like they feel like you have too much control over the relationship. Like when y'all were together, maybe you had too much control. I feel like they prefer to be with somebody who's has, you know, a little low self esteem or somebody who they can control the relationship with. Um, and I see also this person may have a little thing going on where their finances aren't all the way in order either. But they do want to come to you and give you some type of apology or have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you. So that's what I got for you guys. Y'all let me know what's going on in that comment section below. As well as if you're new, be sure to hit the subscribe button, click the bell so you can get the notifications. All right. So until next time, guys. Ciao.